Yes, yes, no! <laughs> Why did I do that? What? What is that? All right, ladies and gentlemen, we have something special today. Today I have a Super Mario Brothers 2 ROM hack. This is actually a big deal in the Mario ROM hack community. We've seen a lot of Mario World, we've seen a lot of Mario 3, but Mario 2 is a real up and comer and I'm excited to show this off today. This hack is called Super Mario Brothers 2 Return to Subcon by GlitchCat7. I actually love Mario 2. I've always been a big fan. I'm like super nostalgic about it. So the beginning screen looks a lot like the original game. It might even be exactly the same, but now, now we can see. Oh my God, it is definitely not the same. And I actually did play a demo of this at a, a charity event called Mario Masters Coliseum like a month ago. So some of these levels may look familiar in the beginning as we did get to see some of those before. All right, bomb, 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 no. All right, here we go. Let's try it again. Big jump, big jump, get the bomb. Jump, 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 throw, perfect, there we go. Snipe the dude, perfect. Get the shell, throw the sh- I disagree. I don't know, man. Mario 2 is just very unique, you know? It's very unique. It's not like any other Mario game. Probably because it wasn't a Mario game at all. All right, up the vine. I think we get a checkpoint every time we get to a new screen. You can also jump like from one side of the screen to the other, like they kind of wrap around. It's a Mario 2 thing. All right, so far so good. Here we go. Right up the thing, here we go. Snipe him, nice shot, nice shot. No, 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 no. Okay, we in there. Can actually go to the left right there. Kind of looks weird. <laughs> Gotta get used to it. So for that, yeah, see how freaking weird this is? It's actually amazing though. It's so much fun. Oh no! Oh no. Can I jump over the top? Can I jump over the top? Nope. Can I do a shell jump? All right, we gotta reset here. No, 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 no! <laughs> Can I still do this? I don't know if I can still do this. I'm probably, no, I'm probably gonna die. Oh, I did it! I used the uh, invincibility frames to uh, charge up my big jump and get through there, nice. All right, cool. Well, we're doing shit now. So you get like this uh, super jump in Mario 2. If you hold down, he gets all shiny. All right, Birdo. All right, one more, one more. I gotta get this one, this one here. Here we go, just gotta carefully. Okay, all we gotta do is reset. Just climb the vine, go back up. Bada bing, bada boom. It's like it never happened. <laughs> I mean, you might as well just die anyways because you restart right here and you get your power up back, so. I don't know why I bothered. It's kind of hard to get used to uh, throwing stuff because it depends on Mario's momentum, like how it, like the trajectory of the thing that you throw. It's kind of weird. Let me in, let me in. All right, stage one in the books. Oh, so now we have a Luigi level. So he was able to make it so that you could only play a specific character in each stage. So the levels are kind of like tailored for that character. Oh gosh. Because uh, I'm assuming most of you know this already, but maybe you don't, but every character in Mario 2 has very specific properties. Like Luigi jumps really high and he's super floaty. 
Alright. Gotta jump. Like, he can really do some crazy shit. I gotta say. Pretty awesome. Alright. There we go. I don't know how I didn't die there. Okay. Grab the thing. And I suck. Wait. Do I need him? Maybe I don't need him. No, I had it, dude. I was in there. I was in there. No! <laughs> he bonked it. I thought you could go through it. I guess not. Ugh. These duck jumps are amazing. No, no, no! What the hell, dude? So the side of the spike doesn't hurt you, which is way different than, like... Mario World or Mario 3, where touching any sort of slight pixel of a spike will murder you. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh! Alright, all we have to do is kill that guy. Easy. Oh. I was honestly fully expecting to miss that. What a nice surprise. Ooh. Oh, we're going, we're going! Grab the vine, yes, yes, no! <laughs> Why did I do that? The game is pretty uh, generous with the one-ups. You have unlimited lives, which is nice, and, you know, pretty typical in a Kaizo hack, but you also get a power-up in every stage. Oh, I fucked that up big time, dude. <laughs> what am I doing? That's, no, that's not right. How do you do that part? Okay, run, run, so just, oh yeah. It's that easy, you just gotta do that, right? Throw the key, get the key, jump up here with the key, kill the dude, yeah, I remember you can kill that guy. Ooh, there was a heart, but I didn't need it. Boss time. Dude, that snipe. That snipe was out of control. Oh, uh, yes. Two for two. Oh, you can actually jump in the air. Oh, I didn't realize that. I thought there was a ceiling. All right, we got this, because I have an extra hit. Let's just take the hit, or not. Let's just kill the bitch. Get in that mouth, here we go. Suck it, Birdo. Princess Peach stage, here we go. There's like a weird trick, like you can grab the key and then float away. Or, pfft. fuck, dude. <laughs> okay, there's some weird tech I have to learn with Peach. Hold on, how do you do this? How do I do this? I completely forgot. No! <laughs> okay, so... I have to jump first. Yeah, that's how you do it. That's how you do it. Okay, I got you. Okay, so jump, float. Okay, so I had to figure out how to fly with Peach. I got it now, though. It's a little unintuitive. You have to, uh, you have to jump to refresh the float. So, like, if you land on the ground, it doesn't give you your float back. You have to actually jump again. Oh, boy. Oh boy. All right, here we go. Let's go. The Princess Peach stuff is insane. I mean, look at this. It's amazing, right? It's pretty amazing. Oh, that's hard. What? What? What is that? All right. There we go. Wait for the jump. Wait for the jump. Perfect, perfect. So we're gonna do a little bit of this sweet action. There it is, there it is. He's gonna stay, okay, good, good, good. Now this is a part I definitely remember from the demo. This part is awesome. Let's see if I can pull it off. First try, here we go, ready? Oh shit, wait. Oh, I forgot, you have to pick it up again. No, dude, I'm 
still alive. I'm still alive. Here we go. <laughs> Damn it. So, check it out. Pick up the thing again, float, throw it again, bam, there it is. That is like the coolest shit I've ever seen. I mean, come on, how do you... Saved! <laughs> yes! Yes! It's Mouser! Let's get him. Freaking Mouser. Oh god. You can grab those out of midair. Alright, there we go. This is so cool, man. Like, man. So cool, I said man like four times, man. Yo, look at that shit. I'm crabbing bombs in midair, throwing them back up there. It's crazy. It's crazy. No! What? What is going on? Ah! Come on. Come on. Freaking mouse. Come on. Yes! So powerful. Alright, in the door, we made it. Nice. Is that the end of the demo? We got a toad stage. I can't remember if I've seen this far. I think this is all new stuff. Alright, fuck yeah. More bombs? Ugh, fucking bombs, dude. Oh my god. Do I need this guy? Did I screw myself? Oh my gosh. He definitely likes the uh, bombs. I and mean, the bombs are pretty cool, so I can't really argue. You know? Oh, damn. This is so much fun. Oh, what? Come on. <laughs> what? Come on. That bomb blast needs to man up already. <laughs> I don't know what's happening here. What the fuck? No, oh, no. What the hell was that? That was... Quicksand is impossible to get out of. <laughs> hey, do not go into the quicksand. Like, at all costs, do not go into the quicksand. It is absolutely horrible to get out of. Okay, now we have to go into the quicksand. I guess that's okay. Alright, get the... It's another bomb. I knew it. Freaking bombs! No! <laughs> Oh uh, my god. Okay, you get it you get like a small window with the quicksand. If you hit the jump button before it's pretty short. But he'll jump right out of it. But if you wait too long, he gets sucked in. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> you spit on me. What the hell? I wasn't expecting that. There we go. Got it. All right. Just, we're good, right? We're fine here. Let's go in the door. That's all you gotta do. Get the cherry, get the little guy. What do you do? Oh, you can dig, right? I don't think that's what I wanted. Uh-oh, whoa, whoa, damn. Fire, dude. Okay, how do we really want to do this? Is it possible to... How do you... I'm trying to figure out how to... not fall down and die. You know, there are a lot of cherries in the uh, stage. I wonder if I need all of them. I don't think so, though, because... Maybe you do. If you get like five cherries or something, a uh, star will spawn. Um, two things. Do I need that? I don't know. I'm just gonna keep going. Oh, this is not okay. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Oh, we're good. What? <laughs> that hits you? Shit. You could duck, probably. I gotta figure out how to do this part. How do you do this? I don't get it. Every time I dig, I fall and I die. <laughs> and I don't understand it at all. Those cherries have to be mandatory. There's no way they're not mandatory. There's no way those cherries aren't mandatory. Right?
right? What am I doing here? I don't understand how to do this part. Oh. Oh, if you run. Yo. Okay, if you run at it, you can dig it up without falling. Fuck this fire guy, man. Get out of here. Alright, so we are definitely gonna go get all the cherries because they're absolutely mandatory. Usually, in the vanilla game, if you get like five cherries or whatever it is, a uh, star will spawn, and that always carries over throughout deaths and stages and stuff, I think. But he may have modified it so that it doesn't do that. Dude, that little guy respawned and he fell down. Could this be any worse? Are you kidding me? <laughs> what is going on here? Alright, got the cherry. That is not okay. <laughs> what do I do now? There's a bomb, but what do you do with the bomb? Can you walk on the bomb? Maybe you can jump off the bomb. That's a weird... Oh, you can. You can... You use the bomb as a platform there. <laughs> Come on. I was digging. Let me dig in peace. Wait. Couldn't I? I could kill these guys, right? I mean, if I had good aim, I could have killed that guy. Oh, I made it. I made it. Power up intact. Power up intact. There's the star. There's the star. Hey. There it is. Oh my gosh. Wow, <laughs> dude. We did it. Nice, alright. Oh, shit. Alright, so... This is, uh, interesting. It looks like we're gonna get a star again and maybe kill Birdo with it. Is there a Birdo? I don't know if there is a Birdo. Also, this quicksand. Ugh. Yeah, there's a Birdo on spikes. Yeah, this is, uh, this is really cool. Yeah, that, that wasn't... I mean, honestly, that wasn't very cool, but... That water is safe, right? Yeah! Okay, come on. Come here. Come here. Hurry! Hurry, Toad! kind of a scary one to get last. You should save the other one for last. That would make it easier. Alright, we got a Luigi stage. You know what? We got about 32 minutes of content here. Cut down, maybe not that long, but let's check out a little bit of uh, this level before we call it a day. Because I'm having a hell of a time here. And... You know what? I'm not ready to quit yet. Awesome. Alright, folks, that is, uh, you too. I don't know, the levels are weird. They're kind of like, I mean, many screens and a boss are chained together to make one level, I guess. So it kind of feels like we've done a ton of levels. I'm on 2-2. Two, two. So we've done a Mario level, a Luigi level, a Peach level, and a Toad level. Now we got Luigi again. This is really fun. I'm enjoying it a lot so far. Like I said, I'm a big SMB2 fan, uh, and I think there's a lot of potential with Kaizo hacking for this game. As you can see, there's so many cool little things you can do. And as, you know, and as this grows, we'll see more custom stuff, more opportunities. Um, I think, I think there's a bright future for Mario 2 and the ROM hacking community. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know if you want to see more Return to Subcon. I'll probably be streaming it on Twitch too, if you want to catch me there. Uh, be sure to drop by and say hello, twitch.tv slash Thank you all so much for watching. See you in the next one.